Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Product Decks. Today I will show you how to add the free shipping progress bar onto the cart page of your WooCommerce store. So your customers can track how much more do they need to spend to get free shipment. Because if you're like me, you hate to see your shipment price more than the product price itself. This progress bar encourages your customers to buy more product in order to get free shipment. You sell more products and your customers get free shipments. Everyone's happy. So without further ado, let's get started. First of all, make sure that you have the product text plugin installed and activated on the site. Now from your WordPress dashboard, go to the WooBuilder section of product text. From this page, you can create the entire website, but we're going to go to the cart page since we're going to focus on the free shipping progress bar. As you can see, there are quite a few templates which already have the free shipping template bar. So you can just go ahead and import them. But I'm going to import card template one since I'm going to show you how to manually add a free shipping progress bar in any card page. I'm going to take some space to add another block. Then click on the plus icon and search for free shipping progress bar. And that's it. Your free shipping progress bar is ready but if you want you can customize it according to your need like the text you can change the text to anything you like you can change the color of the text turn it to whatever you want black was fine color of the price green was fine change the typography border and so on you can even customize the progress bar like you can set it above the text or below the text change the height you can change the color of the background change the fill background and you can even change the radius to give it a more edgy look if you like that so that's how you customize your free shipping progress bar now let's see how this looks in the front end. So there's our free shipping progress bar, which is not filled yet. So I'm going to increase the quantity of chairs, then click on the update button. And now it's filled. So I have free shipping. Next, I'm going to show you how to set the minimum amount that is required to be on the cart page so your customers can get free shipping. Once again, from your WordPress dashboard, go to the settings section of WooCommerce. Then click on shipping. I already have a zone, so I'm going to click on edit next to the zone. And towards the bottom, you can see the shipping method. I have a method already applied and I set the value to 500. So this is how you set the minimum amount for free shipping. But there are various other methods that you can set up free shipment with, like with coupons and so on. To learn more about how to add free shipment in WooCommerce store, check out the blog post. The link will be in the description below. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any more questions or suggestions, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that bell icon.